you uh, you want to know why I did it, why I killed all those girls. All right, come closer and I'll tell you. It's because I liked it. <laughs> I mean, I don't expect someone like you to understand what what it feels like to hold someone else's life in your hands, to be in control. There's always that moment of acknowledgement between the victim and the killer. That moment when they realize that you're the one in power, that you're the one in control. And you know, they, they look at you and then you look at them. And they're looking into those eyes, begging, pleading for their life. But, but you only have a second to decide to, to save them. Well, that's that's great. You could you could give them back their lives, give them back to their family and their friends, their loved ones. But now, to kill them, ooh, now that's something different. Let's let's take a look at these girls. You had the artist, the musician, the actress, the dancer, the model, but none of them deserve their lives. I mean, they. They were the best, they were the best, but that didn't mean anything to them. And personally, I've never been the best at anything. I mean, I've always been, you know, smart, but never smartest, no, no. I've always been pretty, but never prettiest. But despite all that, I knew one day, something deep down inside would make me great. And I will be. Right? I can tell by looking in your eyes that you're you're disgusted by what I've done. You you're horrified. You think I'm some kind of monster. But I can I'm, I can guarantee you that you're not going back to your boring lives and just going to forget all about little old me. Oh no. I'm I won't bet that. I'm going to be on your mind for quite some time.